and welcome to the Vidami Blue iPad and iPhone Setup Guide. We know you're anxious to get started, but please take a few minutes to watch this video on setting up your Vidami Blue and iOS device so that all necessary settings are configured properly. Before we begin, make sure that you've already registered your Vidami Blue and installed the Vidami Blue Mobile for Safari extension. Instructions for doing this are contained in the email that you received when your Vidami Blue was shipped to you. If you need us to resend the email, no problem. Just drop us a line at info at vidami.com and we'll send you another one right away. The Vidami Blue should be turned off and Safari browser closed until later in the setup. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is set the Safari permissions for the websites that you would like to use with your Vidami Blue. Permissions are website preferences that allow you to customize how you browse individual websites and provide you with the security of choosing only those sites that you want to use with the Vidami Blue. To begin, open system settings on your iPad or iPhone and scroll down until you see Safari. Once you find Safari, select it, then find and select Extensions. Next, locate and select Vidami. In the list below, set permissions by choosing your favorite compatible website platforms and changing the default permission settings from Ask to Allow, like this. Repeat this action for any website or platform that you would like to control with your Vidami Blue. If you don't want to allow access to a particular site, just leave the setting to Ask or select Deny to block use. It's important to note that most Vidami Blue compatible websites use either the YouTube or Vimeo video player, and some use both. So you'll probably want to switch the settings for YouTube.com YouTubeNoCookie.com and Vimeo.com to allow. Next, return to the Safari settings window. Scroll near the bottom of the screen and select Request Desktop Website. On the following screen, make sure that All Websites is disabled. This ensures that the compatible websites display properly in full screen mode. When not using the Vidami Blue, you may find that re-enabling this feature improves the appearance of some websites. Next, return to the main settings screen and locate and select Bluetooth. Power on your Vidami Blue by sliding the power switch to the on position and you will see the name Vidami Blue appear in the list of other devices. Click on Vidami Blue and in the following pop-up window, choose Pair to connect the Vidami Blue with your iPad or iPhone. Now you're ready to begin using the Vidami Blue with Safari. Please note that all compatible websites must be used within Safari and not through standalone apps like the YouTube app, etc. If you're using an iPad, open the Safari browser and navigate to a compatible website. Then, use the address bar or the search window to enter the URL for the desired website by clicking on the small keyboard at the bottom right of the screen and opening the on-screen keyboard. If you're using an iPhone, you must first disable Bluetooth to perform the search. Then, switch it back for operation. There is no option for accessing the on-screen keyboard when wireless input devices are connected to the iPhone. And that's it! Now you can find your favorite song, artist, or instructor video and enjoy the freedom of learning, performing, and creating with your new Vajami Blue. Thanks so much and have fun!